Hi, it's Wazza here with another FX PhD quick tip on Resolve. Magic Mask came out 17. I didn't use it as much, but I think it's really improved in 18. I'm just gonna show you one clip. I've color graded this guy. He is Blackmagic 6K Pocket, 16 bit raw clip, and I'm in a 4K, a UHD project. I'm color managed. I've done a balance grade and I just want to pop him out of that background and more than likely I just want to take the background down a bit so he pops out of the screen. Magic Mask is here. You've got the option to go for a person where you can select personal features. As far as I know they don't have horse there yet and man so I'm just going to go for the object which is this one, this tab here and I am going to draw like a slightly wiggly line through him, through the horse so through the neural engine, it will learn this, and then I will use my track forward and back button here. It's uh, definitely improved than when I first used it. It's faster, I'm running on the M1 here that you can see. If I go to highlight, we will then see what it's given me. It's tracked that. I wanna grade outside of that. I'm gonna make a new node, just uh, and force that key from the magic mask into this guy. Just need to invert this, and then you do that here with your key tab there, invert that. And I'm just gonna pop my highlight there and I think I just zoom, I'm just gonna zoom, get rid of some of the little edges on that by just blurring off that key slightly, like that. And then we can drop the edges down. So I'm just gonna desaturate the edges there, like that, he'll pop out, not over the top, so I haven't really graded him. If I hit play, we can see that there now. Now this is definitely, Definitely improved, it's getting better all, all the time. So if you haven't used it for a while, maybe not since 17, jump back in there and give it a try. It's, it's great fun.